Hey and welcome everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you five different features of Tana that are super powerful, but that you might have missed, but don't want to miss. We're going to cover live searches and parent and grandparent search terms. We're going to cover auto initializing source tags from parent nodes, building titles from fields, multi tagging nodes, and multiple inheritance. So I think all of these are super cool features that I use a ton in Tana and I wanted to show them off to you. So let's jump right into it. All right, so here we are. These are the five things we're going to cover and let's start with parent and grandparent in live search. We have a project super tag here that is currently empty and we have a task super tag that has a field that links to the project is it is an instance of the project tag. Now, what's really cool is that in the project here, I can set up a search, I like a live search for all the tasks related to the project, of course. So I have a live query here that looks for all instances of a task where the project is parent. So it links back one level above the node that I'm doing the search in, right? Now, I could, of course, do this by directly linking to the project here, right? And that would turn up the same two tasks, because that's what we're trying to do. But what's really powerful is that I can do this in a more generic way in the project super tag itself. So I can drag this over here. And I'm going to turn this into the parent search again. And here, nothing to show. But over here, of course, we have again, the two tasks, write video script and edit video. Now, what's brilliant is that this is generic, right? It applies to every project, I don't have to manually set this search. Now, what's really cool is that you can do the even one level deeper. So let's say for a project, I want a dashboard. So I have a dashboard node here in the default content. And I have project goal, description, source material. And I have the tasks. Now if I indent the tasks here, um, you will see that here, this turns up nothing right here. We still find all the tasks that belong to this project because we're referring to the parent of the task search node. And that is one directly above, but there's no task that has the project set to the dashboard node, right? So that's why this doesn't work. What we can do though, is turn a parent into a grandparent. And this will then turn the task search here back on again, and we will find all the tasks related to this project. And now the dashboard I can make nice, I can make uh, view as tabs. And now I have project goal description, I can write stuff here, I have source material that I can link to here. And here is a dashboard with all the tasks that I need no matter where they live. And of course, as you know, I can add new tasks here in the search results as well, right, extremely powerful. And the task will have the published Tana features, you might have missed project already set. So the next thing I want to show off is auto init source tag from parent. <sighs> what does that mean? Sounds super complicated. It isn't. And it's super powerful is what it is. So we have a movie super tag here, and it has title director year and scenes and scenes is our instances of a movie scene tag. And the movie scene tag has the movie that links back and it has a topic, for example. And so let's look at King Richard here. Um, that's a great movie um, from Reynaldo Marcus Green from last year. And one scene I particularly liked was the Cinderella scene. So if I type Cinderella scene, I can tag as movie scene. That's great. But as you see here, movie isn't filled out, right? So movie does not link yet back to King Richard, even though 
it is listed here as a scene in the scenes field. How do we change this? We go back to the movie scene super tag and we select the movie field. And here we select auto initialize to ancestor with this tag. And now if I click this and we go back and we remove the Cinderella scene and create it anew. If I tag this now, tag as movie scene, and boom, movie and King Richard is filled out automatically. The great thing is that works everywhere and with everything, so I don't have to put it into the scenes field. I can also create the cigar scene, for example. And here, now I also have King Richard as the filled out movie. So auto initialize to ancestor tag looks up all the way to see, okay, wherever I, I am, is there a node that is um, my parent, somewhere in my parent tree that is a uh, movie and that's the one I'm going to use here. Extremely powerful, you can use that for tasks, uh, for scenes, quotes from books or whatever, super, super cool. The third thing I want to show off is a build title from fields. So we have the movie tag here. And what I want is to have every time I tag something as a movie, I want to have the title, the year it was released, and the director in the name of the node here. So what I can do is say here, um, build title from fields, title, year, and director. So I type dollar sign, uh, curly brackets, and then title, year, and director um, as the field names I have here. And if we go here, you now see King Richard 2021 Reynaldo Marcus Green is now automatically renamed um, to this, right? And if I do another movie and I say title the departed, you see I get the departed Scorsese and that was 2006. Awesome, build title from fields. Then multi-tagging nodes. Of course, you can apply multiple tags to a node and what happens then is that all the fields from that super tag get combined in that node. So. Let me show you. We have here Oscar nominated as a different tag and the Oscar nominated tag has a field nominated for. And what I can do now is I can look here into the movie uh, King Richard and I can tag this as Oscar nominated and you see this adds the nominated field and I can fill this out. Uh, that's super powerful because it doesn't force you to have like this um, really built out system of perfectly matched super tags every time you can just mix and match um, as you want. And then, and then finally, multiple inheritance. That also sounds dangerous again, but what this really is, is if I have again, King Richard here, I have here the fields title, director, year, scenes, and nominated for, right? Now, what I can do is I can remove these fields. And the fields, of course, always stay there if you fill them out. Um, but I can also tag this as Oscar movie. And that also has the title, director, year, and scenes field nominated for and received Oscar for. So in the definition of Oscar movie, I can um, combine different tags together, right? So every time I apply the tag Oscar movie, I want all the fields from the movie tag and all the fields from the Oscar nom nominated tag. That's super powerful and something I use quite a lot. Now, if you like this video, um, check up here where I'm going to link a video where I set up a interstitial journaling system um, that many people have really loved and if you like this video, you'll like that as well. Also subscribe down below, activate the little bell so you're um, notified every time you get a new Tana video from me. Talk to you in the next video. Bye-bye.